I'll do five a piece on those uh, Sagas if you want to do them. Okay. Is it worth five bucks or not? Yeah, it's probably worth five bucks. Well, that's a good idea. Well, hello everybody. Spazzy W here, your Arkansas picker. This is my first yard sale video in my own vehicle since my truck exploded. Okay, exploded is a harsh word. You know, the motor blew up, whatever. So I'm in my own vehicle and I'm going to yard sales. There are so many out today. Two of my buddies that do reselling, they're having their own yard sales and they live right next to each other. So the plan was to go there first, go to their yard sales first. But there are three yard sales right here in my little town before I can even, you know, hit the highway. So I'm gonna hit those up first, get a donut or something, um, and then we're gonna hit the road and go to those reseller yard sales. Also, my lawyer just informed me that it'd probably be a good idea to tell y'all to do not go pro and drive. How y'all doing this morning? Good, you? Am I a little early? You're fine. I drove by around five or six, or no, it was later than that. I drove around probably past seven or so through here, and I saw y'all still out here yesterday evening. Oh, Lord, we were out here probably from nine o'clock last night. Oh, yeah. <laughs> hey, how much you got on these, uh, these chairs? Oh, they're not for sale. Oh, oh my gosh. I, I went straight to them. I was like, ooh, those are some nice chairs. If my husband wasn't here, I might not. Right, right. Well, thank you. You have a good one. Good luck. Well, not much I need this one, but we are going to hit the road. There's another one right down the road. So this other one that was right down the road doesn't start till 8. I ain't got time to wait around. It just hit seven o'clock. Technically, I'm running behind schedule. I should already be at those reseller uh, yard sales. So we're gonna we're gonna head we're gonna head that way. All right, here we go. Look, somebody already got them a Barbie Cinderella carriage. What we got here? I usually don't mess with these Guitar Hero Live guitars. What's, What's up, man? You doing all right? Yes, sir. I, I, I had a stack of Wii games and some Xbox in here, but I guess somebody already bought those. Yeah, I'm running a little behind this morning. Uh, yeah. Well, I'll let you browse around. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you. Got me a power cable for a, either a Wii or a Wii U. I think that's a Wii U. And I don't need nunchucks. I think I have plenty of nunchucks. Ooh, look at that little bag. We got pogo sticks. Whoa. Brodick's head blocks manifolds. I had a box of a couple VCRs up there too. And a double double deck tape deck. Uh, oh yeah? Tape player. Yeah. You got any hats? Uh, let's see, I had a couple of hats over here. The Budger I hat. Oh, okay. Uh, hot Cotton Brewery hat. Right. Uh, I had a Jaeger hat somewhere. Uh-oh. Looks like it's got bought. Yeah. Oh, I see your box. Yeah. Is that it? Yeah. Okay. Hey, Bill. Uh, oh. VCR is taped up. This thing, I don't, I try, I try to get some signal on this. It's an old TV. <laughs> but I can't ever get a signal on it. Oh, that's cool. And this is a DSLR camera holder. Oh, that's what? cool. Yeah. Whoa. Oh my God. I like this little TV here. Five on that Toshiba. Seven, 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 seven. That's 21 and three. I'm pretty sure those VCRs, I tested those out so they should have one on the So I was going to tell you this, this, and this, and this is 24. Okay. Would you do 20? Yeah. And I can just take this other stuff out of this box? Yeah. Okay. Right, sir, sir. If you want that too, you can just put it in there either way. Oh. <laughs> so, you know, what you got on that? Two bucks. Two bucks. Yeah. So 22. Yeah. I, I bought it because I thought, I thought my, my brother in law was going to need it and he never did. So I'm starting a pile. All right. Perfect. Perfect. Just keep yeah, I want to get them up and get them right. Okay. Ooh. All right. Then when are you planning to do your. Uh, my con? Yeah, yeah, it's, it's uh, a retro con, right? Or, yeah, Arkansas Retro Expo. Yeah. Uh, August 19th. 
Okay. Oh, uh, so coming up. Yep. Okay. Where are you gonna do that? Hotel Hot Springs and Hotel. Okay. Aaron in Hot Springs. Yeah. Um, you got a good good number of vendors and stuff coming, or? Yeah, about thirty ish. Okay. I got a lot of people coming from out of state. People right. I've met at other cons and stuff. Right. Look at Steve here. How y'all doing? Good. Uh, Mark Mark set me up. He told me twenty on this box, right. and then he told me two bucks on this. All right. Now what? Now why y'all doing this? What it was this for? It is for a baseball team that's going to a World Series. Okay. Well then I'm just gonna go ahead and give y'all thirty dollars. Oh, well, thank you so much, sir. Right. I know. Thanks, sir. Good luck, y'all. Thank you. Oh. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Look how far away I parked. There was a lot more people here when I parked, I promise. All right. Now, there's one thing about this Subaru. This thing right here, I know it's like a protector or whatever. Keep the carpet looking nice stuff slides around on this like crazy so i'm kind of debating on just taking this out i don't know we'll worry about that in a minute let's go to chet's yard sale oh, oh, oh i see a playstation there's a man what is going on buddy This PSP needs a battery. I got a battery at the house. I could probably just plug that in and see if it works. All right, let me make a pile. All right, that's what I like to hear. So. Did you get to test this nope. or anything? No, nope. you need a, You need a battery for that? Well, you get. you see the screen? Yeah. Okay. I'll do five a piece on those uh, Segas if you want to. Okay. Mm. We're doing five a piece on these. So I got 20 right there. Oh man. Let's see what year is this? 2005. Still, that's pretty cool. Well, Pokemon, what, notebook, journal? Yeah, journal. Game eyes. Game eyes for three bucks each. He's got five bucks on this FC twin. Oh, I'll oh did you start me a box? Yeah. Thank you. <laughs> on mine, uh -huh. it's 20 so far. Okay. And this would be six. Okay. All kinds of good stuff. What's this? Is there anything in there? No. Okay. Oh, I need this guy right here. What am I at? 26? Now this one's not gonna be yard sale prices, but you might be interested. Oh, okay. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, I don't know anything, but look, it's got. Okay. Mm -hmm. look, look. Hmm. This has got games in it, but. Make room for you. Something out there. <laughs> Five, okay. Two, oh, a game shark. That's cool. Mm -hmm. and, uh, looks like looks like twenty. I mean, that was a bid. So I uh, saw one for twenty-five. And that one's ten. Is ten fair or not? Yeah, I do ten on it because I mean I'm probably gonna keep it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, I need to add up because if I keep shopping, I'm gonna go broke. This is 26, so that's 10. Oh. This, man, I don't know. It was like a... It held a Game Boy in it, I'm assuming. Yeah, and I'm trying to figure out if it was like a display thing for like... Is it worth five bucks or not? Yeah, it's probably worth five bucks. The manuals are probably worth five yeah. bucks, okay. you know. I mean, if you're okay with that, then... oh, gosh. Right, I'll do five bucks on that. <laughs> I just thought it was cool enough. I didn't it is, throw it away. I'm, you know, and I'm trying to, I've never really seen one around, so I'm trying to figure it out. 
talking about this dude? So, here's the thing. It's got a couple decent games in it. It's my well, only issue. I saw... Uh, got Wild Arm 3 and 2, I think. Mm -hmm. Game Shark. Or no, Dark Cloud 2. Is that Dark. worth... Is Dark Cloud in? I, when I saw it, I was like, I think that's worth something. But... That was my thought, too. I, I looked up Wild Arm, but I didn't look up Dark Cloud. Dark Cloud 2. Loose 20. Huh? It goes for 20 loose. Okay. Um, where are you at total wise? Right now I'm at pew, 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 pew. I'm at 41. Well, if we throw everything in, you just do 50. That's these, for the plug, these guys? For the, well, well on, set that aside. Yeah. For everything that's not that handy. So, that, so for that, this, the, game, the memory card, memory card and, the flush. and the flush. So that's 50. Yeah. And then, and then 55. Can I, with that? I can do that. Oh. I can do that. Yeah, I got 55, but I get a reseller discount. So <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. All right, y'all. Well, good luck. Thank you. Woo! That's a good deal. Like I couldn't go, I couldn't go thrifting for months because my truck blew up. See what I was missing out on? See this delicious stuff that I've been missing out on? So I have like, I have two phones. I have one phone that I use for eBay and stuff. And then I have another phone that I use for GPS and stuff. Um, this is kind of my reseller phone. In this car, I do not have anywhere to sit it for like GPS and stuff. So it's just like rolling all over the place. So I stopped at AutoZone and I got me a little vent uh, phone holder. You just stick it in the vent, put your phone on it, blah, blah, blah. I can't open this. Boy, if you don't. Like everywhere I go, I keep a knife on me. And I didn't grab it this morning because I didn't think I'd have to stab anybody. Oh my gosh. Okay, here we go. All right, all right. Well, here's the instructions. <laughs> okay, it's off camera. I got it though. So this is an estate sale in a gated community. Um, I doubt there's gonna be anything for me here. Unless I can go through their trash, but let's check it out. Christmas or no? I'm really needing like an oven mitt that kind of looks like the mix between like a frog and a chicken. Oh, what's this? Oh, there's some value in Christmas stuff for sure. Um, but it's usually got to be vintage and not one of those like weird collector's items. Like, let's look this over here, 1988. Let's look it up. Yeah, see, it pulls up CDs, so um. Ooh, it's all see. you all see. Oh, wow, that's in pretty good condition, too. What year is it? Let's see what year it is. 1991, Yahtzee. Yahtzee, 1991. Let's go to Seoul. You can't find this red one, this red variant. You'd think it'd be the normal one. Ah, it looks like it's selling for like six bucks. There's an arcade in the town next to me and they were looking for board games because I think they want to have like a board game night. I'm gonna go ahead and grab this for them and just give it to them for free. I think I have $3 worth of stuff here. Okay. Got two on that. Okay. Thank you very much. Good luck, I hope y'all sell out. All right, I got me a Yahtzee and a book. Look at this thing right here. Hello. Hello. Would you do 20 on this guy? Do 25. Okay, let me start a pile. All right. Right here. The pile started. in better condition. I'd get all of them. I would. I'd just buy the whole thing. You do like a, a blog on... I have a YouTube channel. A YouTube channel? Yeah. yeah. That's cool, man. Yeah, I uh, buy stuff, resell it, and... Arkansas? Go to cons and buy stuff, and... That's cool, cool. man. Oh Ooh, look at this man. Look at this ugly mini, too. Yeah, I've had a lot. 
Oh, a Peterbilt. That's cool. What you got on Maggie? So, a dollar just for Miss Maggie. What about this cool little Budweiser shirt? I five on that because I really love it. I love it too. I'm gonna like put it on immediately. Yeah. No, I'm just kidding. Um, yeah, yeah. Okay. So 26. Yeah, and then you'll get 31 total. You do YouTube? I do do YouTube. Oh, what's your channel? I'll write it down. We'll check it out. Oh, thank you. Cool. Uh, he's, he's got a card and everything. I yeah. know. I know. Thank <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I mean. I was telling him I do this every weekend anyway, so Cute. I just started documenting it. Thank you so much. All oh, right. absolutely. Thank I think you have some really, really cool stuff. That Budweiser shirt is cool. I almost forgot my cow head. Thank y'all. Shelby is going to love this. Oh, I'm glad I made this stop. Cool stuff. I don't want him sliding around the back with that other stuff. So we're gonna try to find him a little space down here, maybe. Oh God, okay. Oh, there we go. Then I'll just put my trash can next to the cow head I just bought. Reselling's weird. All right, this is my next to last stop. I might stop at one more place on the way home, but I'm almost moneyed out, so I'm about to head home. This place, uh, I brought you here several times. This place is a giant estate sale. They just buy a bunch of stuff, open up a warehouse and sell stuff out of it. This is like a reseller hub. Resellers get here, they open at nine, so resellers, sometimes they'll get here at seven, 7.30 and wait in line just to buy from this place. I'm getting here at a little, up 15 minutes after they open so this place has already probably been swamped but i'm gonna go in here and just see if i can find anything Well, pretty much what I expected. A lot of cool stuff, but uh, since this has become like a reseller hub, um, they know. So they price stuff up pretty high. I say high. They price it up, you know, what it's worth because they know resellers are going to come try to buy it and resell it. And they're actually open on Fridays. I'm here on a Saturday. So it's super picked over, which is fine. I've had some great pickups today. I just like stopping by here. I've, I've stopped by here you know almost every weekend for like the past four or five years anyways there's like one more on the way home i'm gonna try to hit that up then i want to get home and show shelby her cow head how y'all doing? Doing? doing good good there's lots more stuff inside that's what i like to hear every bedroom every closet oh the closets closets drawers <laughs> and it includes the drawers the drawers okay everything I'm gonna go for closets. Oh, look at that little Burger King cup. I'm trying to see if I can see what year it's from. I get my flashlight out, but I like looking at these closets. Oh, cool with closets. An Oakland jacket. What's that? It's a work jacket. Okay, I'm interested in. Let's see what it is. American Red Cross. I might ask them because if it's like a quarter, I'll get it, you know. I want to look through another closet. <gasps> oh my god. A Philips TV with a VHS loader. Ooh, I gotta look that up. Mm. Hmm. I'm gonna ask them about it. Hi, sir. You got a little TV in this room in here. A little uh, TV up in the thing. Those are part of the security system. Okay, that's fine. I just wanted to ask. Yeah. Thank you. Well, it's part of the security system, so we gotta leave it here. Bam. Well, I just said I want you to buy cameras like this. Ugh, I'm gonna ask him what they got on it. They're selling stuff pretty cheap, so I'm gonna ask him. You got a little camera in here. What do you got on the camera? Um, I won't. Well, actually, there's kind of a problem with selling that camera. 
We've got. Does tapes. it have something on it? No, we have the VHS. We have the tapes. Yeah. And and in here is the little adapter. Adapter. If you don't mind missing the adapter, to to play the little tapes on a on a. Oh, okay. You need that. I need that. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Well, how much for it? How about uh, ten dollars? Yeah, I have a YouTube channel. Is there a tape in it? No, this, okay. this thing's a little broken. Would you? Maybe that's what I seen was that. Could you do five on it? Sure. Okay. No, maybe that's what I seen was that. So I'll definitely have to sell that thing for parts, but five bucks wasn't bad. What about this guy? Uh, five dollars. Yeah, I do five on that. Okay. Okay. Okay, and the box is right here. Oh, okay. Fancy. Alright. Alright, I think I'm gonna check out here. Uh, we said five on that. Right, five on that. Five on that. And then I just got knickknacks here. Twelve dollars? Twelve dollars, that'll work. Yep. Well good luck. I hope you sell out. I got me a box full of stuff, man. I appreciate it. Good luck. You too. Ta -da. I think I saved it with my I think I saved it with my foot. Yeah, I need to return this. Oh. I'm done. I'm going home. All right, we're back in the room. I have, look at all this stuff. This this that is oh god. I haven't had a score like this in a minute it's 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 been a while uh before we get into this i just want to tell y'all real quick i am putting on my very own convention it's called the arkansas retro expo it's going to be retro video games some vinyls some vintage clothes a bunch of cool stuff i got some youtubers coming retro wolf 88 is going to be there if that's something you think you'll be interested in i'm going to leave a link below to the website let's get on to the finds you can see my nice beautiful knockoff crocs i have here um so this is a old portable tv from jp jp jc penny it's letters together you know anyways um i plug it in it works uh, obviously you can't like tune it to a station because this old analog stuff don't work anymore um not a lot of sold comps doesn't look like it's very sought after I, i'm gonna put it up for 10 bucks that kind of undercuts a few of them that have been sold for like 15 17 but uh yeah th that's what i'm gonna do on this this guy right here um there were no sold comps but there were several listed for sale and people were listing them from like 30 to 70 it was kind of a wide range untested gonna post it for 30 bucks and just leave it at that this guy right here makes me sick one of these sold in the box for over $300 but um, without the box and without a remote and just how it is uh, looks like it goes for about 25 which is what I got on it all right we're back over here uh, this guy right here this is a Toshiba this guy actually has some sold comps up to 50 but this one has like a burn in it like a little uh, I don't know like something got melted on it so because it's a little damaged We'll just go for 25 30 on that one. This guy surprised me. Shelby came in here and she was like, Solitaire, look at that. That's cool. Um, about 10 bucks. I'm going to put it up on the screen right now. But one of these um, sold still in the box for like 100 bucks, which is crazy. This is just uh, a Wii U power thing. I'm keeping that. This Yahtzee thing, I'm going to donate to an arcade in my town. This is a vintage builder's pocketbook goes for about eight. First aid book goes for about five. I'm gonna keep this guy. I'll have to clean this dude up but he goes for about 20. So if I get him clean and nice looking I think I could post him for 20 and it'd sell pretty easy. This one is so cool like it works like it like lights up and like all that and whenever I press the take a picture button y'all hear that? The ding dong ding dong sounds like a door opening on a chevy or something but that's neat i think i can sell that for about 20 bucks i love the box look at the box like very very 90s sparkles 
cool very cool very cool all right right here close to me i bought these two eye toys for three bucks each they go for like six um i grabbed them because i really need one i had one before but it was broke the um the it didn't have its feet on it so i'm definitely going to keep one and the other one i'll probably slap five bucks on this sell it at a con another game boy bag um 15 is what i got on that i think i can get 15 out of that uh it obviously uh has some problems i'm gonna untangle this and see what's going on there i don't know if it like broke or if they did this so they could tie it somewhere really tight i don't know i don't, I don't know what's going on with that this playstation book this is pretty cool so um it's got some games in it this harry potter game you know it's like eight bucks this thrillville game is like six bucks uh, but this Game Shark goes for around 15. Dark Cloud goes for around 20. Wild Arms goes for about 13. I think that's it. And back here is a PlayStation Underground uh, notebook. I'm running out of battery, so we better hurry up. These dudes, I can. I'm gonna clean these, and then if I put 10 bucks on them, they'll sell all day at a convention. I sell plushes of Mario very, very easy at conventions so this had some sold comps up to like 150 with everything and everything working so right now this is untested i still have to test it the door is broken on it see that um i saw one sold parts only for 30 bucks if this doesn't work and i sell it for parts only which i probably have to anyways because this door's broke i think i can sell it for 50 because i have the box and everything everything's in here the charging cable everything some extra film uh, i think i can get 50 bucks out of this these are segas these are also untested yet i have to test them but um if they're working good i always include you know power av cables and at least one controller is how i usually do them and whenever i bundle them like that i almost always get 50 easy playstation one another one pretty much the same deal about 50 bucks uh, this Maggie, I'm probably going to keep her. I have a Bart. Ta-da! I have a Bart. There's your sister, Bart. I can't set her there right now because there's no space, but uh, yeah, I found her. Budweiser shirt. If this fits me, I'll keep it. If not, I don't care. I, I'll, I'll, I, only, I only got five bucks into it, so this was just kind of a, you know, if it fits me, I'll keep it. If not, whatever. This PSP, I charged up a battery, put it in it, and it would not come on. So this is the lost cause. I'll put this in the $1 bin at my convention. And this is just like a hat. Okay, and I wanna show you all this too real quick. So this is whenever Game Boy sold the Play It Loud series, this is a case it would come in. Game Boy right here, uh, some game, a game right here, and then like a manual right here. I think that's how they did it. So this obviously doesn't have the Game Boy or the game in it, but it has the Game Boy manual, the manual to Donkey Kong Land, Another Game Boy manual instruction booklet. Sorry. Um, this is a this is a poster. I'll pull that out in a minute. This looks like a poster, but it's not. It's like an advertisement to get you to buy more stuff from them. But here, let's bust this dude out. Look at that. That's pretty cool, right? Play it loud. Beautiful. Guys, thank you for watching. Thank you for uh, checking out this cool stuff that I got today. I think this was a pretty good haul. This is only like my third yard sale video for this yard sale season. But this is good stuff. This is, I, I'm glad I went today. Um, fa fantastic stuff. If you like what I'm doing, if you like the vibe, please hit that like button, subscribe, and hit that bell notification. That way you know every time I upload and sometimes when I go live, because I do be going live. I love you guys. Thank you for watching. Y'all keep picking.